that? Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> but just a quick one. Those, those shoes are mine. Oh. Tommy, to, Tommy was the last in the hand-me-downs. So he got them. So I'm at the, out when I was a little boy, those things. And here, yeah. you notice that the shoes are scuffed. So he's been walking around. And when we've not been watching. Yeah. 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 Anyway, Tommy was my mother's ventriloquist dummy, and, and when she died, I started to look after him. And since he's, he's been with me, he's um, he started swearing. <laughs> well, we never did that with my mum, you see? Yes, so that's, anyway, that's, that's what, anyway. That, that's my only joke, yeah. <laughs> that's my grandmother, right? Uh, professional ventriloquist, uh, Madam Langley. And in that photograph, that's Annie, there. So she's over 100 years old. My grandmother was on the stage from 1911, and that poster, right. the poster. Yeah. I'm going around there. Sorry. Josephine Langley, that's her at Leeds Varieties in 1912. Oh, top of the bill. I didn't like the fact that it was Harry Lauder's brother. That's right, yes. Yeah, well, it's a bit. Uh, yeah. and but they... I, I really want to see the, the four Mexicans. <laughs> were they you know, really I, Mexican? I know, they well, well that's, the, that's the point, <laughs> isn't it? They were. They're really not likely to be Mexican, are they? <laughs> yeah, absolutely, yeah. But, but uh, that's real yes, history. Let's see it, is that? That's me, Uncle Morris. Uncle Morris. Right, I'll, I'll do the story. That's my grandmother. Uh, that is Uncle Jimmy, her brother, who taught her ventriloquism, mm. who got her into it. That's my mum as a little girl. She went on tour with my grandmother since when she was two. Uh, so she had a, a fairly poor junior school type education, was going around the country to, for various things. And that's my mother with Johnny Green. Right? And so that's my mother now, in the, well, in the 1950s, with Tommy and Annie, these two dummies. Mm. And when my grandmother died, my mum got the little girl doll and her brother, Maurice, got the little boy doll, Johnny Green. And when he died, it was in the Magic Circle. The Magic Circle had a, a, a celebration of his life, and this is it, where they brought Johnny Green and Annie together for oh. the first time for 70 years. Which is just... That's extraordinary. Okay, that's my brother, because I had a concert and I couldn't do it. Yeah. And those are some of the scripts from my grandmother. Uh, written by my grandfather. Incredible handwriting, isn't it? Mm. Mm. What was the, I mean, did Venturistic have the same kind of uh, um, repartee? Like, was it funny or was it some yeah. half truth? Was yes. it yes. saying well, the, the, my the naughty yeah. things? What was my, it? My grandmother always used to introduce something that's local, like a strike, mm -hmm. supporting. Uh, the workers at such and such factory. She'd always do that bit of research, yeah? But she really had, right through her career from 1911 to, was it something like, yeah, 1911 to, um, to 21 or something, about 10 years, yeah. Uh, she had three acts. Mm -hmm. That's all, three acts. Three, yeah, uh, seven, right, seven. Right, through, right through those years. I mean, today, a comedian, if he goes on television, that's it. Mm. That's one thing done. If he's on tour, mm. right, he's got that act, and, mm. he, and he can tour it, do it mm. in various mm. places, mm. but as soon as he puts it on, on CD, or does any of those gags on television, that's it. He, he needs so script writers do a lot in those days. You know? You could go around the country with that's three at, acts. Uh, and be on, on both 10 up, years, you know? On, I mean, on, one, one act, one act's gonna last you back, like, well, um, three years or more. Or was it at 10 minutes? Yeah, you know, something, like that, something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So she discussed kind of like always local. Well, the, the, if she the, could the, be, there'd be some, could be, there. some, yeah. some local reference. That's right, yeah. I mean, I mean there, that, that's her at, at the at Coliseum mm -hmm. in London, which is all opera now, but mm. uh, she was there. It, it was a musical type place. Did they tour the country with other? Sure, but I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, together, no, I don't think. They were separately booked, yeah. 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 So she, she, she played at all the Moss Empires. Is, uh, 
Yeah. So you've got a booking from that That's particular right. venue. Yeah. And the policy was part of the Empire. And there she, I come from Burnley, there she is at the Burnley Empire. <laughs> Have you seen the movie, the uh, Stan, Stan and Ollie? No, 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 you shouldn't. Right. Right. Yes. No, yeah, I mean, a lot of it was very, very good. But the cheeky chappies saw it, who were kind of double act. Yeah. And if they say it was good, then it's going to be good, you know. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, I think yeah. you'd like that because it brings in a lot of um, the contractual obligations, yes. all that sort of right. thing, you know, apart from the same troopers. Yeah. And, and this is Tommy in the York, yeah, many years ago. I once brought him to an exam committee. Uh, it kind of uh, offended, <laughs> offended the committee. external um, examiner. But my boss, Colin Saxton, um, put Tommy on, on the list, <laughs> on the attendance list. Oh, fantastic. Yeah. So he was there. We're going to get to you. Are you going to come with us? Um, um, that's, I mean, that's great. That's uh, Brian Briggs is going to be giving a lecture. But I've finished, really. Mm -hmm.